Hey guys, Eric Sue here. Hope you're doing well. Welcome back to another episode of Goality Lifestyle. Today is going to be a fun one today because today I'm talking about the Google Hub Max. So stay tuned. All right, you guys, if you're new to this channel, welcome. I know you guys will get a lot out of this. So remember to destroy the like button, subscribe button, and notification button so you can get future videos just like this and it helps the YouTube algorithm. And if you're a returning subscriber, welcome back. I know you guys will get a lot out of this as well. All right, so today I'm gonna to be doing an unboxing and review of the Google Hub Max. And this is the bigger version compared to the Google Hub. I believe um, the difference is that the max is 10 inches, some other features, and um, the hub is just seven inches um, screen wise. Okay, so um, big difference between the two is also that there's a security camera on the hub max, and I'll show you that as well. But I'm gonna go ahead and um, unbox this right now. It's brand new, and if you're wondering where I got this one, it normally costs $229 through the Google store. Uh, maybe you can get it on discount, like 189 maybe. But I went on to Facebook Marketplace, another favorite place of mine, right? And I got this for $134, okay? And so you can look around and uh, find it in your local area, but I got this for $134, okay? Anyhow, I'm gonna go ahead and unbox this and I'm gonna show you um, where I'm gonna put this as well, how it works a little bit for me and why I um, got it as well. Okay, so let's go ahead and unbox it and see what's inside. I'm gonna take my scissors right here. Okay, let's go ahead and crack it open. Whoa, look at that you guys. Pretty big screen, right? Not bad. Okay. Just one piece of uh, unit here. Just one unit. Right down in here comes with the let's get started manual. And behind here up on top, the charging cable right there. And everything else is packaging. Okay. So I guess all you have to do is plug this in and it should start working. Okay. And so let's go ahead and do that right now. All right, you guys. So I'm back here in my living room area here on my kitchen table. And I'm going to go ahead and connect this uh, Hub Max up. And we're going to go ahead and set it up. Okay. So let's go ahead and do that. On the unit itself, it's a 10 inch display. And then it has, I believe, um, the camera and then the mics and the sensor up on top. And then it has a mute button on the back and this huge speaker here and stand for the um, display. Right back in here is the plug and plug it in. There you go, you can see it turned on. Okay, just like that. And I'm assuming it's gonna go uh, through some prompts to help me set it up. Okay, so let's go ahead and check that out. I'm gonna go ahead and take this screen off. So I'm gonna go ahead and set up a device. Looking for a device. It says Max Hub Found. I'm gonna hit next. It's connecting. Okay, and it has uh, this code, I believe I'm gonna have to put in maybe in this phone to connect it and it says follow instructions in the Google Home app. Okay, it picked up the, the same code you can see here. 
right there. Okay, same one is over here. And that's a yes. I'm going to agree to some terms. Help improve Nest Max. Okay, I'm in. And where is this? This is going to be a living room. Okay, so simple prompts. And I'm going to connect to the Wi Fi. Yes. So far, pretty straightforward in um, setting this unit up. <clears throat> the reason why, again, we got this is because we wanted something that is kind of the central hub to the other uh, mini hubs that we have, uh, mini nests that we have. And so um, this would be perfect for us to use as well as a video camera for Zoom, for duo meetings, um, and then also just watching YouTube's so when we're taking a break here. Set up Google Assistant and it has all these other options on here. It's updating here on the um, display. It says about your display's camera. It has camera sensing. It has video calls and messages and built-in Nest cam features. So that's really cool. It's actually an um, indoor camera as well. It says use camera sensing features so that um, allows your Nest Hub Max camera to recognize things like faces and gestures to personalize your content and help interact with your device. It has voice match and personal results are on as well. It says your device is ready. I don't want the YouTube ad for free and we can set up these um, music and photo frame and things like that. Looks like this is already um, ready to go. Looks like this guy's ready to go. I'm selecting some photos to use as our photo display. It says it's almost done on this guy. Since I've already um, set up my mini um, mini nests, this is already like straightforward. It already knows what my preferences are. I can set up zoom as well. On here it says finish setup. So I'm going to go ahead and add my zoom information. All right, you guys. So one of the cool features on this unit is the Nest Cam, and I just um, went ahead and connected it through my phone to uh, this Nest Hub Max. And um, hopefully when it finishes up here, it's going to go ahead and allow me to use this as a camera. And, um, and so, okay, let's see here. It says Nest Cam Monitoring. And so hopefully uh, when this pops up, uh, I can use this Nest Cam on here and I can see what's going on on my phone. Okay, it says it's connected. And so let's just see what it shows me. It says video stream is available and video being viewed. Okay, it looks like it's on, it has a green light right up in here. Okay, all right. So I don't know if you can see it, um, but I'm putting my hand up on here and on my phone, I can see already um, what I'm looking at. Okay, so um, right now I'll turn it away and you can see over here my hand. Okay, and I'll put this block over here and you can see it. I'm waving it right there. Okay, and so um, that is a cool little Nest Cam feature here, okay? All right, so the Nest Cam feature on this Nest Hub Max is one of the great features that's on here. But the other things that are really cool here is that you can actually go in and you can set up uh, music, you can set up YouTube, Spotify, um, you have uh, Duo, which is video calling, 
you have calendar on here you got meet google meet uh, you also have i believe netflix is in here as uh, um yep netflix and then you have zoom on here okay and so um zoom click on that and you can go right to a meeting and go right to um a video conference call whatever you need to do and so it's really great um and so i like that idea of already going right into some great apps um let's see here you can do everything you could do uh, within the google nest mini but with this one you have a video display which is really great and um, i think we're going to enjoy uh, having this around in addition to the other minis that we have in the house not only so that we can um, broadcast as well but we can also just um, see what's uh, going on in the world as well with um, google assistant okay and so we're going to enjoy this i hope you guys um, get one yourselves if you guys do um, you can go ahead and follow the uh, steps that i did to set up the google hub max and um, hope you guys enjoyed this video if you guys did remember to destroy the like button subscribe button notification button so you can get future videos just like this and we'll see you in the future bye